Scott, Scott with Bloodline Media and and you film Spooky Empire 2023. It is Saturday, and, and the stream of, of creators that are coming over here that are somehow tolerating my form of interviewing without <laughs> my daughter is amazing. But these gentlemen kind of approached me, and I'm looking at the one guy like I kind of know him, and they were talking about, oh, we, we had this little film called Take a Walk on the Wild Slice, which I went, oh. And I looked at <laughs> Ron over here in the middle, who played the, uh, I, I won't give a lot away, the critic. And I'm yeah, like, man, you did such a good thing. job because it. you were the biggest thing in the world. I didn't think of it as a compliment. I said, yes, of course, because, I mean, he did a job. He, he's a nice guy in real life, right? Sorry, like he's a really nice guy. Oh, he's really okay, nice right? Really nice but guy. he had just this whole, air, it was just like some actor's nail rolls, no matter how big or how small. And you were perfect. Take that in the most complimentary fashion. I really do take that as a so. compliment. It's like Umbridge from Harry Potter. Like, I'm sure she's a lovely woman, but she was a bitch. So I, yes. I really take that yes. as a compliment. Yeah, she Thank was very so nice much. in film, and she was like this horrible person. I, yeah, I said that. I did. It's okay. But she's over there. You'll she never see this anyway. Um, but, but so I, I, I'm glad because I definitely voted for You guys know I watched the film, but amount of, like was able to not recite all the lines. But something pepperoni. Not going to give it away. Definitely there's pizza involved toppings and a horrible food critic <laughs> but gentlemen congratulations thank you welcome thank to spooky empire and congratulations to have your film in the festival so uh tell us about yourselves and them about your picture because i i'm gonna say too much so sure. gentlemen take it away ken <laughs> yeah you know uh so i'm ken i uh, had the honor of co-writing it it was nick's idea actually so uh we have this collaboration where we just throw scripts in between each other and uh help produce it help write it and uh love filmmaking you know and we got to get this guy ron to to star in it well i appreciate you guys uh tolerating me for a couple of days in in your house it was real nice to meet you and then uh bleed all over your house so thank you very much for that uh, I'm Ron. I am a uh, local musician or uh, actor in Orlando. I, I do a lot of stuff in there, and uh, I worked with Nick uh, many moons ago. And we did we work together at Walt Disney World? Yeah, we don't we don't well, work there anymore. We do not. No, you don't live here, and I no I longer live quit in my job. So, <laughs> but we made a movie together. But we made a movie together, and we're very excited about it. Yeah, I'm I'm just excited to be here. I, I'm I'm nervous to show it to people for this is the first time anybody's going to see it other than us. So. Uh, but it, it, it went over well. It's a relief, honestly, to hear that. And, uh, you know, it's going to be... I've unclenched now. Now that, now that we've talked to you, like, I'm like, okay. Not me. I I'm, like, still, I'm still like, uh, uh, there's so much editing left in a film. Yeah, you yeah, know? I'm just like, like, hey, what the hell is that guy now? If some <laughs> random guy that we've never met is like, oh, I like your movie. I'm like, I don't, you know what? I think we'll be okay. Yeah, we're just we're just excited to see how it goes, honestly. And... So far, I guess the reaction's been good. So that is very um, promising. That's a relief. Yeah, promising. So, uh, it's a relief. So, so is there? It, and I and I don't want to ask this because this is one of those stories. Like, well, what inspired you to make this film? But there, I, there I, I have to. I have to know. So, one of you had, or perhaps multiples, had a, a situation with either food or perhaps a critic. I, I can't. Let me sh shut up and say too much. But. I no, not not really. What it was was Ken and I had made a, a short before this, a five-minute short focusing on social issues and some really heavy stuff, and we showed that to an audience, and it was it was just depressing. It was just dealing with right. like heavy stuff, and afterwards, I was just like, "What can we do that is the exact opposite of that?" And it was just I don't know. I eat a lot of frozen pizza, and I guess it's just one of those things you look at it and like, let's throw Ronnie's face on there. I, I remember <laughs> uh, when we were shooting this back and forth about what's the premise of this film and Nick mentioned that uh, we're going to have this man eating pizza. Nick was like, I'm not sure. And we, we talked, we collaborate all the time. So uh, he's just like, well, maybe we go this way. I'm like, whatever happened to the pizza idea, the man eating pizza? Uh, he's like, I don't know how we're going to pull it off. But somehow we did. Yeah, we, we knew... The effects look better than I thought they were gonna. They weren't. They look so good. They weren't meant. They were meant. It was meant to just be dumb fun, and uh, so hopefully we pulled that off. But yeah, it's it's, it's just meant to be fun. But it, and and it, and it was. It was fun to watch it. I enjoyed the heck out of it, and I just laughed. I watched it a second time. I'm like, I really like this. And I really like this. I said, man, this. I tried to figure. You reminded me of somebody I knew at the time. I'm like. My He's just, but, but and I knew, and I thought back. But as an actor, I said, I pray to God, 
he's the exact opposite in that life because that means he crushed this role. Because otherwise, it would just be it was just him being a dick like he always is. <laughs> but so that's fantastic. So I'm I mean, happy about that. I like that. to think there's a little bit of me in there, but like I don't think I'm a dick. I, yeah. I, I think I'm a jolly fellow, <laughs> not not so much uh, the Oliver character that that I played. But I, I hope people like it i hope they could see my range as, a, as an actor and it was interesting because it was very easy for you to find the character oh yeah oh my god like you like i got the script i was like this is my character now i'm like all right just a pompous ass all right I mean, I like we, we did a table read i didn't know it was going to come out of his mouth and he did that and i just started cracking up yeah yeah likewise oh my gosh uh, so this is the first venture the three of you have kind of done together, all three of us together yeah. you know, but you've all done separate things before. Yeah. Yeah. This. This is yeah. Just, and I, it's our second short together. Yeah. So and first time here. Yes. First time here. Really super proud of it. You know, we were up against a deadline, but mm -hmm. uh, just so glad that we got accepted. Fantastic. Uh, any social media for you gentlemen? Facey, uh, Facey underscore Young Productions on Instagram. You can find us. We've been posting this whole weekend there. Um, and then uh, more collaboration to come between the both of us. Hopefully all three of us. Hopefully. Yeah. yeah. And, and well, well uh, uh, And then I am uh, Ronnie Gross Jr. on all platforms, R-O-N-N-I-E-G-R-O-S-S-J-R. -S -S uh, you'll find my music where I'm playing in Orlando, uh, whatever uh, theater projects I'm working on lately. Um, come see me at Universal at Grinchmas this year. And yeah. uh, that's mostly it. Yeah. R Ronnie's a very good musician. He plays all over the city. And, ah. it's, and it's, he's, he's, he's a Good original artist as well. Thank you very much. Yeah, and you, you figured out that on Spotify, now, now you're dabbling in acting. That's fantastic. Yeah, it's fun. He's got a good range. Well, congratulations again to all thank three you of so you. Thank, thank you for, for thank taking you the time to speak with me, and thank you for making the film because it made me laugh I'm so happy. in a lot of ways. So you brought a smile to my face, which was good. It's about you definitely accomplished your goal, which was to go from something horrifically serious and real to the first world problem just taken over the top <laughs> and, and, and it, it was just it was it was done fantastically well so thank you guys Word. from thank the bottom so of my much. heart i'm glad you guys made it and we were able to come by thank, thank you so thank you so much my pleasure you. and enjoy the rest of your weekend gentlemen all right thank, thank you, you. Take care. thanks yep